All right, kids, I decided to go ahead and just make this video to get you guys familiarized with what products work, where to find them, and how to take them. I am not done with the full uh, plan yet. There are some other items that I have found that I've introduced, but I'm still testing them. Um, but everything that I'm going to show you in this video is what I take every single day, every single day. You got to do it every single day. And it has an immediate effect on human body communication and electronic harassment symptoms. So if you have been thinking your whole time getting hit with this crap, that there's no way out, I promise you, there is, I promise. I would not get online and make an ass out of myself by trying to sell you something that doesn't work. I would not, I don't lie about, I don't lie about anything. I don't, I don't have to. I'm in the wonderful position of being able to tell the truth. People don't like that very much. Anyway, okay. So for starters, one thing that will neutralize any kind of burn that you may experience taking any of this stuff always, every day, start off with lemon water. All you need is purified, preferably plasma cleaned and alkaline water. That is going to be your mo most helpful way to drink water and try to use a real lemon instead of lemon juice, but it doesn't matter. If you add a little bit of the citrus oil from the peel, even better. So this is necessary for the following products. And I apologize for having to do this off camera, but it is what it is. All right, that one hurts. This one definitely hurts. And this one hurts. All right. Now there are two different types of, actually there are three different types of oil of oregano. This one is a miracle product. Like I can't even tell you how much this has helped me. So it comes in a format in drops where it is in a suspension oil. It comes as an essential oil and I put this into my lemon water and it comes in gel capsules. Now these I take at night with food, but if I'm experiencing a sudden surprise, I usually will take the drops because they're immediate. Now, when you take the oil of oregano, the other miracle product, apple cider vinegar. I know this isn't a balsamic vinegar thing. It's apple cider vinegar. I've got a big jug of it in the kitchen. And then iodine, potassium iodide drops, which is typically made from kelp. These three things, when you take them together, are very, very intense. I was completely unprepared for how intense these are going to be. So please remember, lemon water will neutralize the burning sensations down your throat and esophagus and your internal digestive system. So these I take as needed. Um, like I said, I put oil of oregano essential oil drops into my lemon water, which I drink all day throughout the day. Um, it's carbonated uh, and we have a re reverse osmosis alkaline water treatment system with a separate spout. And that's the only water I wish I could bathe in it, but that's the only water I will drink and cook with and give to our pets. So these products you absolutely need. In fact, I would even say you need all of this stuff. So apple cider vinegar, oil of oregano capsules, or oil of oregano in a suspension oil, or oil of oregano essential oil. And the queen of the trio, potassium iodide. Now, some people are very, very sensitive to this, and I am not. I, I'll show you. You're only supposed to take one drop of this a day. Here's a full dropper. 
Now, in some people, if they did that, they go probably a little mad. But since I personally have just decided that this kills off the fungus, that's all it does for me. And this works instantaneously as well if you are experiencing an attack. That's a bad word for it. If you get yourself caught up in a field of nonsense. All right, next is, that's not necessary. I'm trying to do necessaries only. Turmeric or curcumin, both excellent for moods, for stabilizing moods. It's great for your digestive system. It's great for depression and it is great for vitality. And for men, it has other benefits. All right, next, spirulina. You can find this in many different types of forms, but I opted for these capsules because I still don't know if these work, but I like the way they taste. And my cat loves these, he eats these, like he's not supposed to, but I do give my cat some of the stuff because he goes outside. Next, we've got two different versions of the same thing, and that is Yerba Prima, Yerba Prima Bentonite Clay. This is the most leaching uh, ingredient in this detox cleanse. Um, I have opted to take the capsules for starters because this can cause severe constipation and dehydration, which I already have issues with. So if you want something that's gonna be more effective and work really well, get the liquid form. I haven't tried it yet, but the testimonials for this versus this are almost night and day. However, this has chelated so much metal out of my body that my it makes the godforsaken mercury that my brilliant dentist put into my teeth when I was like 12 years old. Um, yeah, so bentonite clay, good, good thing to have. I would even say add it to your bath. Add any kind of kaolin clay to your bath. All right, next we have chelated magnesium. There is a difference between magnesium and chelated magnesium. You are trying to get metals out of your body, among other things. So you want to stick with uh, chelated magnesium. I only take one of these at night with food and it's strong. It's very strong. Uh, if you have constipation, magnesium and vitamin C. Problem solved. All right. Next is ginger. Ginger is a very powerful, very potent antifungal. So I have noticed this has uh, helped with the fungus that I sometimes get in my toenails. I think probably because of this nonsense, but there's a lot of different type of fun guys out there. So ginger uh, in powder form, I'm sure that eating it raw is much, much better, but I don't have any and it's kind of expensive here. All right, next, my favorite, honey. I'm gonna make a separate video talking about sugar because sugar, in my opinion, is like throwing gasoline onto the fire that is already burning. When you are detoxing, it is incredibly important to stop eating anything with processed white cane sugar. You can use turbinado sugar, but you're still gonna get, you're gonna undo some of the work you've done. But if you stick to like honey, especially honey, because it also has amazing antifungal qualities among many, many others, like royal jelly would be probably the best for this. But since I'm an encaustic painter and my medium is beeswax, I feel like I've already stolen so much from the bees that I don't take royal jelly, but I imagine it might be more effective than honey. You should go and find out. Um, the agave simple syrup is also decent. Maple syrup is fine. Just make sure that they're real because a lot of the times they just take corn syrup and dye it brown and flavor it. Next is potassium citrate. 
I'm sorry I haven't been giving you guys the milligrams. I will try to fix that. Um, hopefully you could see them. Next is Aviator's Oxygen. This works immediately. It doesn't work like permanently. You will notice your symptoms return. But when you use this, especially in tandem with the potassium iodide, this knocks it out. And uh, let's not forget the apple cider vinegar. This stuff is amazing. Like if you, do, if you don't get any of this stuff, at least get this. Get yourself some apple cider vinegar and then take it Take a shot of it three times a day on an empty stomach. It burns a little bit, but man up, get used to it. And you will see for yourself that you notice an alleviation in your symptoms. I promise. It's affordable. It's at every grocery store. Apple cider vinegar. Don't get capsules. Get the liquid. All of this stuff is ideally consumed in liquid or like whole food format. For example, for potassium, I eat several bananas a day. I probably eat too much bananas. Um, some honorable mentions, I wanted to uh, recommend maca root. Was used in uh, Aztec culture as an antifungal. Uh, my favorite antidepressant in the universe, ashwagandha root. That stuff is awesome if, you, if you're if you moody. And then more oil of oregano. And the oil of oregano comes in 180 milligram soft gels, not gel capsules, sorry. Um, the turmeric is 450 milligrams. The spirulina is 100 vegan tablets. Um, it, that's all it says. And that, that is literally just like compacted seaweed. It's like an umami tablet. 70% uh, carvacrol oil of oregano. So it's suspended in carvacrol. I don't know what that is, but this stuff was very intense. This is the most intense. That's why I only use 10 drops per this thermos. And I just drink it all day and throughout the night. Uh, the liquid kelp, potassium iodide, and by the way, this is for thyroid gland support, so there's that too. Uh, 800 micrograms in a 1.6 fluid ounce, which is 50 milliliters. I apologize if uh, everything is backwards. Here is the liquid bentonite clay. I really love this brand, Yerba Prima. You can find a lot of this at Whole Foods, but what you really want is a shop like this. It's a local herbal organic, oh, sorry, baby, market. It sells everything. Like you can do all your grocery shopping there too. Any kind of like Asian market or place that is not a grocery store and especially not a chain. Um, maca root, gelatinized maca root, doesn't give a uh, strength. Ashwa ashwagandha root, I don't know how much is in, oh wait, sorry. 350 milligrams. You can get this in powdered format. These are liquid inside of a capsule and these are my favorite. Always take ashwagandha root with something in your stomach. What else? Uh, potassium citrate, 99 milligrams, which is only 2% of your daily value for potassium. So we are all probably potassium starved. Uh, the bentonite capsules, 500 milligrams of bentonite clay in each capsule. I take one to two per day. Chelated mag magnesium, um, 200 milligrams. I should have done this before. The ginger is 500 milligrams per capsule. And then all this other stuff is basically to taste. Just please try it. Even if you think I'm out of my mind, 
I'll make you a bet. If you have been diagnosed with a mental illness in the last 30 years, and you do this detox for one month without skipping a day, I will bet you, and I will pay up, I will bet you 100 American dollars, which is like 10 euros or something by now, that that mental illness magically disappears. You have nothing to lose aside from like, at most a hundred dollars, at most. You can get a lot of this stuff on Amazon, but please be careful. There's a lot of sketchy people selling things that aren't real. Like this honey I got specifically because it's local. If you can get it local, do that. So that is what I am taking currently. There are some other things that I've added to my diet or detox, but I'm not comfortable yet talking about them because I'm still testing them out. I just got turned on to them. So I will give you guys updates as it goes. Um, I would say that uh, I bear, I never think about electronic harassment ever, unless like I think about, I feel guilty for not making videos. So then I think about that, but mostly my, I'm, it, it doesn't ever cross my mind. Even when I can still kind of feel it, it just, it's like, what's the point? And I will say this again, I am fairly certain that once you demonstrate to this technology that you are onto it and that you know, not think, not trust, but know that there is a cure for this infection, it stops investing time in you. Why not try it? You have absolutely nothing to lose, but you do have everything to gain. I hope this video finds you guys well. If you need anything, you can always email me at Beth is a real lizard, all one word, Beth is a real lizard at Gmail. I apologize for not responding to all of you in a timely fashion. I got more emails than I anticipated. So please try the detox. I beg you. I'm begging you. On YouTube. Give it a shot. Thank you for listening.